The tough economy is hitting everyone at heart, especially nonprofit organizations whose purpose is to help communities. But one group here in Los Angeles has found a way to channel creativity and make some businesses look better at the same time. Eyewitness News reporter John Gregory shows us how. They're learning to stay within the lines on the paper and in life. Students at the Alliance County District School for At-Risk Kids who are getting in touch with their artistic side. It allows me to express myself in a different way other than writing or through music. It's mainly like the discipline you get and the inspiration you get to express yourself. It really helps you out in terms of reaching a goal. The art instruction is provided by Theater of Hearts Youth First. The nonprofit is always struggling for funding, but it's even harder in a recession, which is why Theater of Hearts is turning to a unique way to raise money. They're lending the student artwork to local businesses in exchange for a donation. This art lending program is a way that the community, a business, lawyers, doctors, can have beautiful framed artwork in their surroundings and feel that they have empowered a youngster. This is an example of some of the artwork that's appeared in some local companies. And keep in mind a donation to the Theater of Hearts program is also tax deductible. Theater of Hearts thinks it's a win-win. Those who provide a donation get to keep the artwork for a set period of time. Meanwhile, the donations keep the program in place, and instructors insist they can see the difference it makes with students. Once we get started, it, it, they start creating the, the, the artwork and they start, you know, I guess, um, believing in themselves that they could create something beautiful. Creations that grace the school's walls, drawings and paintings, and other works created by kids who, without this program, would probably never get the chance to show the artist within. In Inglewood, John Gregory, ABC7 Eyewitness News.